What is going on everyone? Snickle here and today I have another Platinum Trophy video for you guys. I'm going to be getting the Platinum Trophy in Resident Evil 7 Biohazard for the PlayStation 4. The last two trophies that I do have to get are Just Get Me Out of Here, which is to complete the game within 4 hours, and Resource Manager, which is to complete the game without opening the item box more than 3 times. I did do these in the same playthrough, it wasn't that difficult, but anyway, with that being said, let's get right into this. Here is the end of the game, and I didn't want to give too much away, so you might not know what's going on here, but this is my third time playing through the game, and every single playthrough was very enjoyable for me. Madhouse did grind my gears a few times, but on my very first playthrough, I played through the game using less than three of the first aid med kit things, so that was one of those challenge trophies done, and then the other challenge trophy um, I got here on my speedrun, so there's Just Get Me Out of Here. Then we get Resource Manager, and then we're going to get this Platinum Trophy, Bio Splattered. Anyway, that being said, let's take a look at this list. Here it is, 73% with a Platinum, and I didn't do any of the two current DLCs yet because I don't own them and I don't plan on buying them anytime soon because of the pricing of them. But the game was very enjoyable. I did play through three times, and each time I played through the game, it was just an amazing experience. I knew what was going to happen, but the atmosphere of the game is just so amazing. Like, you just sit there and you're like, oh, I know this is going to happen. But just everything around you and the noises, and if you're playing with headphones, especially the noises, you just hear stuff here or there, and you're just like, what the fuck? Like, that's, it, it's really, really creepy, and if you haven't picked it up, definitely pick this game up either when it's on sale or, you know, whenever you have some extra money, because it's worth a play, and you should definitely get your hands on it as soon as possible, and the trophies are pretty simple and straightforward as well. Anyway, here's the profile, trophy level 27, 47%, got 5,708 total trophies, got 4,102 bronze, 1,179 silver, 345 gold, 82 platinums, and like I said, 5,708 total trophies. And here's the Platinum Trophy itself. Like I said, guys, this is an amazing game. If you haven't gotten your hands on it, get your hands on it. If you're not a fan of survival horror, you know, it's worth giving it a try because this is such a well-crafted game. And like I said, if you're playing with headphones and you hear all those creepy noises and everything, it's it just makes the game like a thousand times better. If I did have to rate this Platinum out of 10, I'd give it a 4 out of 10. Took me around 20 to 25 hours. You are going to have to do a minimum of two playthroughs, but I suggest three playthroughs. One being a normal playthrough, one being a madhouse and then obviously one being a speed run and then you kind of doing what you want to do with those two challenge trophies that being the item box and the first aid meds but anyway with that being said i hope you guys did enjoy the video if you did be sure to smack that like button leave any questions or comments down below if you're not subscribed consider subscribing and i hope to see you all around sometime soon